Have you ever gazed at the night sky and wondered where did it all come from? Imagine the universe, an unfathomable expanse of space teeming with galaxies, stars and planets. It's so vast it's almost impossible to comprehend. But where did it all start? Enter the Big Bang Theory, the leading explanation among scientists for the origin of the universe. Picture it. About 13.8 billion years ago, a massive explosion, the Big Bang, set the stage for everything we know today. From the smallest particle to the largest galaxy, all were born from this single cataclysmic event. The Big Bang wasn't just an explosion in space, but an explosion of space. It was the beginning of everything. Space, time, matter, energy, the works. It's a lot to wrap your head around, isn't it? So, the Big Bang is not just a theory, it is our best explanation of how the universe, in all its vastness, came into existence. But what happened after this colossal explosion? Imagine a state of incredibly high density and temperature, a moment of singularity. From this singular point, the universe began expanding rapidly. It's like a balloon being inflated, each speck within the balloon moving away from every other. As it expanded, the universe cooled, allowing for the formation of atoms. Initially, it was just hydrogen and helium, the simplest of atoms. Over time, these atoms started to clump together under the force of gravity, forming stars and galaxies. Now you might ask, how do we know this happened? The answer lies in the cosmic background radiation. This radiation is a relic from the early universe, a snapshot of the universe, about 380,000 years after the Big Bang, when atoms first formed. It's the afterglow of the Big Bang, still detectable today. In the wake of the Big Bang, the universe as we know it began to take shape. So what does the Big Bang tell us about time and space? Well, it certainly challenges our usual concepts. The Big Bang theory tells us that space and time as we know them began with this colossal explosion. Before it, there was no time, there was no space. It's a tough concept to grasp, isn't it? This theory also suggests that space has been expanding ever since the Big Bang and it's continuing to do so. This isn't like an explosion in a pre-existing space, but rather the creation and expansion of space itself. This idea of an expanding universe is supported by numerous observations, including the redshift of distant galaxies and the cosmic microwave background radiation. These findings suggest that the universe isn't static, but dynamic and ever-changing. The Big Bang is more than an event in the distant past. It continues to shape our understanding of the universe and our place within it.